a short time ago, Mayor de Blasio approving pay raises for New York City officials. The mayor could get a 15% raise, 23% for council members, and a 37% raise for the council speaker, if approved. But not everybody is happy about this. CBS 2's Dick Brennan live with the full report in Lower Manhattan with reaction. Dick. Well, Dana, lots of reaction. We tell you things may be tough all over, but the mayor says elected officials deserve a raise. He's ready to give it to him. A minimum of 12% across the board for elected officials in the city of New York. And as you say, not everyone is happy about it. City lawmakers haven't had a raise in a decade, but now Mayor de Blasio says he wants to make it happen. He's accepted the recommendations of the Quadrennial Commission that convened last year. It will boost the salaries of elected officials. Members of the City Council will get a raise of $25,815, boosting their salaries from $112,500 to $138,315. But that comes with a ban on outside jobs. The mayor's salary would rise by more than $33,000. It would go from $225,000 to $258,750. But de Blasio says he would not take it for this term. New Yorkers had their own views of the salary boost. What are they doing for us? Absolutely nothing. And we're the ones, the taxpayers, that have to foot the bill for everything else. I think it's very unfair. Elected officials, you know, they shouldn't be in it really for the money, and they should be in it for the service. So I think if anything, civil service commission people who work below them should be getting paid more, not them. If you're an official and you're running an election, you're probably from an upper middle class to an, uh, an upper class, and the money, the raise should be safe for people in the middle and lower class. And I don't think you deserve to have that raise. At least one police union is furious over the pay raise. BBA President Patrick Lynch saying in a statement that the raise is an abomination and an insult to every police officer in this city who is expected to make do with two 1% raises. How dare they accept these unconscionable increases while underpaying the very men and women who put their lives on the line to protect them. Now we can tell you also covered by the Rays are the controller, borough presidents, district's attorney, and public advocate. The city council still has to vote on this one. We're live at City Hall. Dick Brennan, CBS 2 News.